What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. So for those of you that follow the channel, you'll know that yesterday Google actually announced the Developer Preview 1 of Android 13 Tiramisu. We did a first look video on that and here we are today back about 24 hours later with that running as my primary device on the Pixel 6 Pro. And if you guys want to hear something crazy, and this is the whole reason I'm making this video, uh, I have had no issues at all with this beta build. I actually had to obviously reset everything. It did a factory reset when you install it. So it's been a clean install here. And this has been more stable in a developer preview than what I had with the February security patch running on this Pixel 6 Pro. Uh, it's insane, you can see how fluid everything is. I've had no issues, we'll jump all around. Um, I know this has not been the case for everybody, but you can see just how everything's flying. I haven't had any Wi-Fi drops that uh, kind of came up in that February release. Um, but guys, this has been shockingly good. Some of the new features that are built in have been pretty neat to use, nothing groundbreaking, nothing really active different than what you probably would get on Android 12L right now, or even 12 itself. Having said that, a couple random nuances have come up, and I'm not sure if this is directly in relation to the beta, or developer preview one, whatever you want to call it, but now, whenever you actually want to change your volume setting here, if you are not in a mode for getting sound notifications, or on vibrate, you don't have that haptic, haptic feedback that you might have been used to before. So when you like swipe back to go back uh, from an app or something, that is no longer active. And when you actually go into your settings um, for all of that, it actually turns it off so you can't even edit it, um, which is very, very interesting uh, to see that happen. I don't know if that's by design or whatnot, but you can see it's not available because your phone is set to silent. So if I go ahead turn that back on and then go back into vibra vibration and haptics it works not a problem at all so just a little strange but I wanted to call that out there for you guys to see again turning it off you can see that same message there just doesn't want to work um, again apparently it looks like it's by design but just wanted you guys to see that um, I'm able to make all my calls service has been pretty well uh, as you would expect from the Pixel 6 as it was but Literally nothing else has had an issue. Apps aren't crashing or anything of that nature. Everything's running smoothly. When you launch your camera app, it doesn't judder or stutter at all. I mean, you can see it is actually pretty, uh, pretty good. Let's take a picture. No shutter lag. So it's not even giving me... Okay, there was a little processing lag there for a second, but... Nothing crazy at all. Uh, definitely good to see. I'm hoping that in the next build next month, we'll have even more stuff fine-tuned here as well. And if you guys didn't see it before, this is what that build number is. It's TPP1.220114.016. And if you want to see right in... Oops. Let me get back to where I'm trying to go. Back to about, there we go, right back into Tiramisu as the Android version, and you can see your little uh, Easter egg right there for that. But everything else, like I said, it's been fluid, been solid, haven't had any issues uh, at all. If you guys have any questions, throw a comment down below. I'll be happy to look at it and let you know what I have found or seen or if there's anything else outstanding. Uh, I'll be happy to touch base with you guys. But for now, that's it. Android 13 is off to a very promising start. Let me know what you guys think. Drop a comment down below. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace.